Welcome to Droppy, where we take your dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Jacob. I'm Nathan. I'm Karina. And I'm Julia. And you know what my favorite thing to do is when I see a monster? Um, uh, the backflip. That, that's part of it. That can be part of it. So, sit down. Somersault. I Jump usually into its don't mouth. sit down. No, not jump Splits. in the mouth. Um, what I like low. to do is is take uh, uh, Macarena dance. Ready? I like to take <laughs> this, a, a sword that's bigger than my whole body, and I like to chop and the monster it. into pieces, and oh. then wear those pieces as my new clothes. That's kind of messed up. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of messed up, but also it's kind of fun if you think about it. And yeah. there's many people that agree with me, and one of them is in our Patreon Discord. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, they are. <laughs> and their name is Flycatcher. Oh, the flies are kind of like little monsters. They are. You would need yeah. to catch a lot of them to make yeah, armor to out wear of them. them. Yeah. Unless you're really gross. Unless you're very small. Yeah, yeah <gasps> but which I'm not. size. <laughs> you stop that. So Flycatcher <laughs> said, "All right, I got one, guys." And they did, to be fair. Yeah, they got yeah. us there. Armor sets from the Monster Hunter franchise. I'd love to see if you could take some of those and turn them back into creatures. Ooh. Possibly yes. new monsters or even anthro characters. The catch is that you can't know the original monster design. So that's what we're going to do. I've prepared for you some armor sets from Monster Hunter, and you're going to imagine yeah. what the monster they done came from might look like. Easy, and, and I, I can't don't know. know. I don't know. I don't know, and I can't You know. don't know, and you simply cannot know. I've never known. Nathan, you're up first. I sure am. If you click on the folder that says Nathan, you can eyeball it up. And there's your armor oh, set right there. Oh, cowboy monster. Oh, how fun. It's a monster made of cowboys and pizza. Oh, uh, this is a Texas Longhorn restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> you had to kill a Texas Longhorn restaurant. Yeah, not, not a Longhorn, just a whole restaurant, a yeah. building. <laughs> Nathan, can you draw a character as a whole building franchise establishment? <laughs> it's kind of like a Denny's now that I think like about it. It's kind of like a Denny's. <laughs> what I, what yeah. I will tell you, Nathan, is mm -hmm. that this armor set is called the Ragi X set, and it comes from the monster called Ragi. Ragi, Ragi. X. Yeah. I loved that snowboarding game, Ragi X. Are you thinking of SSX? Yeah. Mm, not close enough. No. <laughs> Sex. You're gonna, I, ha you're gonna have to do one that's closer. I love to watch the skateboarders compete in the Ragi X games. Nope, still not it. I still not it. Ragi. It's what Scooby Doo calls. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. I couldn't think of anything. It's what um, Scooby Doo calls <laughs> when you have a skateboard competition in Wales and everything's really rocky. No. It's the it's the when, it's yeah. when you have a skateboard far. competition in Wales oh, and you're rocky. like how are the conditions out on the skateboard track, Scoob? And he says, it's not very clear. It's kind of roggy. Oh, so it's like foggy. Yes. Oh, okay. Because he says yeah. it. Did, you know, I, he did says I it. do it? No. It's, okay. still, if, it's okay. still pretty bad. It's like, it's like if Scooby-Doo was a YouTuber who played video games and okay. he was playing Silent Hill and he was trying to describe the atmosphere and he goes, really roggy. Yeah, <laughs> like foggy. Yeah, yeah. Like foggy. In the game. In the game. Silent, Silent Hill. Hill. I think the actual joke, okay, here we go. I yeah, got it. Yeah. I got it. Okay, yeah. show us how it's done, yeah. Jacob. So That's even your name. So <laughs> in, in Maryland, yeah. you yeah. know the Maryland accent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very we well. All, we all know the Maryland accent. Yeah. So in Maryland Scooby calls Shaggy Shoggy, except he can't say it right, so he says Roggy. The Roggy, he says rot roll rock the Roggy horror picture show it's a i like nathan's nathan i think did nathan it. got there the fastest nathan did it Roggy horror picture show it was right in front of us <laughs> we're all dumb we're all dumb i think we're all stupid we're all dumb <laughs> okay but what if yes 
You don't have anything. No. Mm -hmm. Call out. Call out post. Damn. Julia lies about having a joke. So you're drawing Scooby-Doo? Yeah, this is Scooby-Doo. <laughs> My favorite memory. exhibit at the Museum of Natural History is the Raggy <laughs> <laughs> Natural History. <laughs> what are you talking about? What is the Raggy exhibit? Raggy. It's like the rocks and gems. The rocks and gems. They don't call it the Rocky Hall. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely not i want to talk about what nathan is drawing i don't want to live in this space anymore that we've created this vile room nathan's drawing like a sort of drippy bird it's a pizza monster oh pizza it's Oh, I and then when you Ronnie. get oh, and then the pieces of the equipment are called instead of pieces like an equipment piece, it's like a slice. Ooh, it's like a slice. Armor of slice. Pizza. Okay, okay, I'll allow it. It's Roggy. It's just Roggy. <laughs> so why is it pizza? Because that's what they've got all these pizza slices on them. Yeah, they're very oh, pizza okay. coated. They're pizza coated. They're pizza cowboys, and I feel yeah. like the cowboy choice is like the armor makers aesthetic they chose to do yeah, yeah putting their own little spin on it yeah. and ragi sort of sounds like an off-brand <laughs> like one of those pizza chains like ragi cheese ragi cheese <laughs> <laughs> ragi cheese <laughs> rog <Rag entertainment cheese <laughs> is his full name i think this episode has gone wrong <laughs> I'll allow it. <laughs> I didn't expect us to get hung up on the word Ragi for so long. I thought we were just gonna like accept it. I mean, you made a point to like state its name. Well, yeah. I just Is this not you what you know. wanted? I just wanted you to know for I, information. See, I don't I like. I don't like certain sandwiches that have too much sauce because then it gets raggy. That You're just making the same jokes now, basically. <laughs> I you, didn't, like... you didn't preface that by explaining that you were Scooby-Doo. Yeah, you I, have yeah. to be Scooby-Doo. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I don't... I think it's implied at Hi. this point that Julia Scooby -Doo. is Scooby-Doo. Hi, I'm Scooby-Doo and I don't like... <laughs> Hello, Scooby-Doo. <laughs> I don't... Here's a feeling I don't like. When I'm wearing socks. Scooby-Doo oh. Scooby steps up to the mic at the comedy club. Hello. I'm Scooby-Doo, and here's a feeling I don't like. You ever... Hey, you, is it, hey, hey. Is this a, hey, has this ever happened to you? Uh, I'm Scooby-Doo, by the way. Yeah, please remember that. It's going to be Hi. important later. Yeah. Hi, I'm Scoobus Doobus. You ever experience when you're wearing socks? <laughs> <laughs> and you're walking around <laughs> around your house or apartment and or a lake. All, all of a sudden you step into something wet and you're like, ew, now my socks are roggy. <laughs> I'm Scooby Doo, remember? I'm Scooby Doo. <laughs> it seems like maybe you forgot. <laughs> yeah, it was Scooby Doo. The deafening silence is telling me that maybe you forgot I was Scooby Doo. So, let me just so as a reminder, you. <laughs> <laughs> I am Scooby Doo. <laughs> Please keep that in mind. <laughs> Please clap. As I repeat the joke. <laughs> Let's start it from the top. Do you know who my favorite cute. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> Do you. Do you know who my favorite cute monster is? I thought you said Q-tip. My favorite cute monster, the Balrogi. That's a Balrog. <laughs> Why From... is it cute? From Lord of the Rings? Yeah, well, it's, yeah, uh, when, when, it's you when you it make cute. it when you add a little e at the end, then it's then it's cute. <laughs> that makes it cute. The Balrog, like a little cute version of it, is a Balragi. I guess it does sound cuter. Comment down below what you would call a cute version of the Balrog. The Balwag. The Balwag. 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 Oh, I like that. Balragito. Yeah. Sounds like just a little guy. Yeah. Ito at the end of anything sounds like a little guy. You know, I feel like we need to talk about. No. That the fact that we have depicted and discussed Scooby-Doo so much this year, so far. Yeah. Probably our most talked about <laughs> character this year has been Scooby-Doo. Mm -hmm. Is that like... In our streams and in our episodes. Is that this year's... That's like the Droppy Zodiac. It's the character that we're like obsessed with that year. Yeah, yeah. last year was the year of Goofy. This yeah. year's the year of Scooby. <laughs> <laughs> Next year, I mean, who knows? Who knows what cartoon dog it'll be? <laughs> it could be any cartoon dog. 
Auggie Doggy was close. Up. Oh yeah, that's Auggie true. Auggie Doggy could have been it if yeah. we had, if we had really. <laughs> Auggie Doggy burned too fast and too bright. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but we got Scooby on a simmer, and that can go all year. <laughs> Like a never-ending stew. We just keep putting more Scooby in. Beautiful soup. Yeah. Soupy. Soupy do. Soupy do. Soupy soup. <laughs> Soupy soup. I don't this know is a what. a good creature, by the way. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, I feel like you've clued into some Monster Hunter <clears throat> design choices, like the wings that they walk around on. They like to do that in Monster Hunter. Oh, for sure. And so I feel like you have noticed this. With I, have your, no I have noticed this. Your monster noticing brain. <laughs> <laughs> Nathan's the best at monster noticing of any of us, I think. I won't I won't debate that. Thank you. The Drophy Award for for best monster noticer goes to Scooby Doo. Oh dang. I, I, was <laughs> wow, sure I, was gonna get <laughs> I thought I was gonna get it this year. Or maybe next year I'll get it. Um, yeah, here's hoping. Here's hoping. Scooby Doo notices all sorts of monsters though. It's like part of his job. Yeah. I don't really just know do what it. I'm doing here. Just do it. You're just doing go. it. It's like yeah. happening. It's just there's a lot of sort Use of your like monster noticing knowing, please. Please. Yeah. I think you're doing great. This is yeah. a very fun design. Okay. And I then like they... that it's big and strong. Yeah. Sort and round. Big, strong, mm -hmm. round, and made of pizza. Yeah. That <laughs> they, sounds like pizza. Ideal. They don't pizza, do a lot of pizza. Pizza is strong, round, and made of itself. It's true. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. That's so true. Bestie. Bestie. Bestie or zesty. <laughs> or Scooby. Or Scooby. <laughs> so true, Scooby. <laughs> We're going to start saying that. <laughs> There's no food-themed monsters in Monster Hunter as far as I know. Okay. So you're saying that Nathan isn't correct. No, so, I'm saying you're a pioneer. Oh. oh. Like, a, pizza pioneer. Hey. a pizza pioneer. Hey. I'm saying Monster Hunter does not respect Italian culture. <laughs> the way I am respecting it right the way now. Respecting it. But don't they have the little meow meows? And you oh, can you dress can... them up like Luigi. Like Luigi. <laughs> you can dress the cats up like Luigi. So I guess that balances it out. Yeah. It's very respectful to dress like Luigi. <laughs> <laughs> That is my favorite little monster hunter thing that I learned through osmosis is all the weird collabs they have so that you can dress up the little cats. <laughs> yeah, there's so many collabs. There was an Ace Attorney one. Did you know that? I did know that, yeah. Why didn't you tell me? Because I, I was like a while ago. Yeah. I don't remember when. <laughs> it's probably a long time ago. I think it was before. It was in one of the games that I wasn't playing at the time. I can't believe you kept this secret from me. So I decided to intentionally keep it a secret from you. Typical Jacob. Scooby would never do this to me. No. They did have in Monster Hunter Rise a Sonic <laughs> collab oh, yeah. where they had they had a level where you would run around it like collecting rings just like in one of the Monster <laughs> Hunter levels and it played City Escape. That's funny. In Monster Hunter <laughs> while you did it. Uh, live and learn. That's a different song. <laughs> But they say live and learn in City Escape. They do say it in City Escape, you too. You sound so stupid That's what right I was now, referring Jacob. to. But they also have a song called Live and Learn, where they say it even more. Live and let learn. Oh, the ends of pizza slice. Everything's pizza. Oh, it's like a scorpion tail, yeah. but instead of stinging you, it just kind of slaps you with a slice of pizza. <laughs> I mean, if it, if it has that, like, <laughs> that super hot oil on it, I it does feel like a sting. For real. Yeah. To make that sound, to get that fully, I slap myself in the face. <laughs> you're, you're being real goofy right now. You know that? <laughs> I'm, I'm committing. This is for the people. I wanted them to, them to have. Should I get us? We have some pizza in the fridge. Should I get it and slap myself? Yes. With it? Yeah. I guess yes. I'm not going to do, do that. Do it later. And then we'll ADR. We'll fully it in. Yeah. Well, it's Detroit style pizza. So it's like square and oh. kind of thick. I don't think it would slap the same way as like a New York style Just slice. Just slowly press it into your face. <laughs> Until I suffocate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the move. What's the word? Scooby? Resuscitate. Oh. We'll resuscitate you. I was going to say resurrect. Well, that too. You could resurrect. It me. sounds more mystical <laughs> yeah. than resuscitate. 
<laughs> well, you try to resuscitate me, and if that doesn't work, then you have to resurrect me. I guess. Using mysticism. That sounds like a lot of work, though. Beautiful. <laughs> Nathan, beautiful. Julia's it's done really with this, good. This, this, this segment. <laughs> Moving on. Moving on. No, I, I like this guy, though. This is a fun design. Yeah. I like the big wing. It's like Ninja Turtles Monster Hunter. I do headcanon. Ninja head cannon. Turtles Monster Hunter. <laughs> I do headcanon that, like, when in fight mode, it can kind of unball and it turns, like, it has, like, a extending neck. Oh, you yeah. You know what I mean? Like, it gets long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a bird. Oh, like a cheese pole. Oh, yeah, like a cheese, cheese pole. pole. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It shoot. It can shoot out cheesy webs that entangle you. <laughs> this monster sounds like kind of fun to fight. It's free dinner. Yeah. <laughs> also, we didn't say it while I was drawing it, but Raggy Doggy and Raggy Daddy and Daddy Doggy, Daddy Doggy, Raggy Daddy, Doggy Doggy. What was his name? Ra Raggy Raw Doggy, Doggy Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> Roggy doggy Dilfy doggy Raw dog daddy <laughs> <laughs> No <laughs> um, Nathan if you're done You can you can go ahead and open up your your special folder oh, okay That I made for you And there will be a file in there called Roggy monster Go ahead and click that Oh, oh. You're not far off there somehow There is kind of some pizza elements you're to You're really him. not far off somehow Great work, Nathan. This is a fun design. Thank you. Yeah. I would love to see Karina do one next if we could. Fine. Okay. Okay, Karina, are you ready to see your armor set? Y yes. Eyeball your folder. Ooh. Oh. So this is the Kaiser X set. Kaiser X? And it comes from a monster called Teostra. Teostra. Yeah. I don't know why it's called Kaiser when the monster is called Teostra, but sometimes they do that where the armor is called something different than the monster. And then sometimes it's called the same as the monster. Well, doesn't Kaiser, Kaiser. mean like king? Or it yeah. does. Ruler. Yes. And there are, so in the games, there are multiple sets that come from each monster, depending on if you're uh -huh. hunting a low rank one or a high rank one or a master rank one. Some of the other Teostra armor sets do have more crown-like imagery. Mm. In, the, in okay. the Kaiser sets. So there is a kingly element. A king. kingly. A kingler like element. Horms. Or me king. Or me king. <laughs> <laughs> Go off, horn me king. Well, so this one has horns on the or on the head. Me? The last one had a cowboy hat on the head, but the monster itself did not have a cowboy hat. Yeah. But, but we think that maybe horns is indication. <laughs> just give it horns because. <laughs> well, you're laboring under the misapprehension that there are rules for how they interpret the monsters into armor sets. Um, and there are not fair. rules. They just do whatever they want each time. It's like Digimon. I'm good at that. I'm Sometimes at it's rules. like it looks like you just took the monster and draped it over yourself. And then sometimes you're suddenly wearing like a fancy top hat and like waistcoat that you made out of a lizard. <laughs> sometimes you see a lizard and you're like, I want to make something fancy out of that let's lizard. Let's do a funny yeah. one. Let's do, hey, let's, <laughs> let's get a funny one for the album. And of course I picked this one for Karina because it was, it looked like a demon. I love a good demon. And I know demon. you like a good demon. A demon. Oh, we got collarbones. Oh, we're doing something. This demon's got collarbones confirmed. No. <laughs> no, he's got a he's just got a collar. We're not gonna make it humanoid. We're not gonna make it humanoid. I might make it humanoid. It could be a little humanoid. You could, you could, that's a, a treat. treat. They never go super humanoid. I know that. But some of them are more humanoid than others, but for I have sure. Terminal Digimon brain. If you want to go more humanoid, I'm I not gonna stop you. I don't. <laughs> I don't. And everyone's going <laughs> to call me a monster fucker in the comments. They're going to do that anyway. That's true. <laughs> and it's because you are. Stop. <laughs> You'll embarrass me. <laughs> in front of the monsters. Yeah. What if they're watching? <laughs> I'm just deciding what I want to do. Yeah. The, the face. I feel like. So I've seen Jacob play some Monster Hunter because Jacob has streamed Monster Hunter before. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I feel like I've never retained, not that I usually retain what anything looks like, but I feel like I've never retained like a face of a Monster Hunter monster. Yeah, you're mostly 
getting smacked around by its tail. Yeah. Yeah, that's the impression I get from what I've seen. Yeah, they don't normally, some of them have, I will say this one's got a pretty distinctive face. Okay. More so than most. Interesting. But that's normally, normally they just have like a dinosaur face or yeah. a dragon face. Right. Hmm. Okay. So it's distinctive from a dinosaur slash dragon. Interesting. Um, but speaking of streaming Monster Hunter, Cat. I want to do a shout out because lately on occasion, I've been on our friend Onsta's stream, twitch.tv slash Onsta, playing Monster Hunter Rise with her and some other friends who also stream at Doig Swift, twitch.tv slash Doig Swift. Hell yeah. We've been playing some rides together in the mornings because we're all in vastly different time zones and it's been a lot of fun. So if you follow them, you might catch us playing some Monster Hunter sometimes. Catch them catching monsters. Yeah. Yeah. And you can catch us on Twitch drawing stuff live. Your requests. Monday night, 7 p.m. Eastern time. At twitch.tv slash droppy show. There we go. That's true, Julia. That is true. You can also catch me and Julia playing video games at Speaker Sleepover Society. Wednesdays and Sunday nights. And you can catch Nathan playing video games at Nathan's other show. Whenever I do that. <laughs> Some, you can't, huh? you, Usually Wednesdays, but sometimes I, I'm too busy on Wednesday, and so I do it <laughs> a different day instead. Hell yeah. And me, you can't catch me. No. She's too you fast. You can try though, but Car it's not going to work. Karina's elusive and slippery. I just show up <laughs> places. <laughs> yeah, on other people's streams yeah. you appear. Yeah, and then and cat. then once people notice, I'll be like <gasps> and then disappear. <laughs> <laughs> she's gone. We thought we had her, but she was too slippery. Yeah, she's covered in pizza grease. <laughs> <laughs> she got slapped around by the ragi. Yeah. <laughs> covered in pizza juice. You have like a little dog nose. Yeah. He said, he said it wasn't like dragony, so we're going we're going doggy. Hell yeah. Little doggy demon and demon daddy. <laughs> <laughs> little roggy doggy. <laughs> roggy, doggy. roggy demon doggy daddy. Dilf attorney. Yes. Good good <laughs> he does have a law degree. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> it's a hard challenge designing yeah. a whole creature. Yeah. I covered mine in wing. Yeah. I was just like, I'm going to draw a wing. Well, I'm getting a little bit of like a feather vibe from oh, yeah. The, yeah. the left armor. Yeah, there seems I to do, be... I do like that the right armor, the femme armor, <laughs> is giving me very little, honestly. <laughs> it's kind of giving me more bug than the one on the left. Yeah, it doesn't even have a cool mask. Why yeah. did you get a cool mask? Give her a cool mask. I hate you guys. <laughs> um, Karina, if she had a mask, then you couldn't see her cute woman face. <laughs> did you consider that? The men's faces cover that up. You cover Thank the you. men's faces because as everyone knows, men's faces cannot be attractive <laughs> i wish i was a worm so that i could dig deep deep into the earth and emerge into hades <laughs> <laughs> where all the men are hot <laughs> and all the women are hot yeah and, and everyone's and hot, and everyone's hot. <laughs> listen i got news for you everyone's already hot whoa whoa hotness is a mindset whoa, whoa. you watching this you're hot hate to break it to you Sorry. But you're looking great today. Hey. And you should feel great. Wow. And the greater you feel, the greater you'll look. Is this weird? It is weird, but we're going to do it anyway. Oh, do is it. that a leg? Follow your heart. Yeah. Is that an up leg? Is, doing is it doing like a split seize? Oh, Ooh. Doing like a... oh, like a weird squirt. It's kind of like when dogs have bad proportions and their legs just kind of like stick out. The... Yeah. It's inbreeding. Yeah. Oh, because I could imagine this is like the cut scene when you walk into his lair. And then he rises up. And the dude saying the poem. He monster hunter rises up. He monsters hunter <laughs> rises up. And yeah, the, the dude is. <laughs> you guys playing monsters hunter? <laughs> That's the poem. In Monster Hunter Rise, there's like when you encounter a monster for the first time, if you have the language on Japanese, they're doing like the Japanese like chant, like shrine sort of uh... chant. But if you have it in English, the dude just like says it <laughs> normal. <laughs> like it's a poem. Okay. And he'll just be like, a demon in the cavern, yeah. hunched low 
waiting for prey. The taste of your bones on his lips. He definitely did a pass oh, where he sang it, and everyone outside the booth was like, no, 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 no that's no, not going to no. work. Yeah, it no. doesn't translate the same. It doesn't, it doesn't work. work. Yeah. <laughs> oh, tusk. Huh? No, that's just coming. That's the collarbone. Oh, like <laughs> collar of bones. Yeah. It's not collar bones. It's collar of bones. bones. They are collar bones, but they're also a collar of bones. This is cool, though. I kind of wish they would do more like humanoid monsters occasionally. Skipping forest deity. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. but in hell. Yeah, <laughs> the forests of hell. Hell forest. Like an evil pan. This, this is complete. This is, this is a bitchy one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Digimon is a digital monster. Yeah, and I do hunt them and for they sport. they are the champions. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, raise them <laughs> with love. <laughs> I would dress like a Digimon if I could. You would dress like a Digimon? What does yeah. that mean? Wear a lot of belts. Yeah. And like leather jackets. and Cover the top of your face. Cover so part you, of yeah. my face. I haven't yeah. decided which part. So you want to dress as Beelzebub. Well, a lot of them do that. Yeah, a lot of them are like that. <laughs> hmm. But see, I only have one jumping off point, and it's Beelzemon, or I guess I also know Karibo. Well, That's... you know you know Angemon, <laughs> right? Karibo. The angel guy who's Digimon. covered in belts and has his top of his eyes covered. <laughs> <laughs> I'm moving right along. <laughs> and... Wear Garurumon. Yeah, wear Garurumon wears jeans. Yeah, he wears <laughs> jeans and no shirt. Why are you asking where he is? Because mm. I miss him. Do you not know? <laughs> wear Garurumon. Wear Garurumon. I just want him to bark at me in his adult man voice. <laughs> Arf. <laughs> rar. Rar. <laughs> <laughs> What's another Digimon I know? I know... Solmon. Dog. dog. Which one's the dog? The bounty hunter? Garurumon. The blue dog? Oh, no, it's a it's a bunny. Okay. Terriermon. Yeah. Terriermon is technically a dog. Okay. He just looks like a rabbit and has a twin Digimon that is a rabbit. <laughs> but don't get it twisted. Yeah. Oh, man. That's a dog. We need to do another video where Julia draws things and we have to guess what they are, <laughs> but it's Digimon. That would no. that would be impossible. Impossible challenge. Actually impossible. I could figure it out. I love Digimon. But Julia's already told us all the ones she knows. Oh, don't worry. There's so many. There's so many. But yeah, it was interesting because there was an interview that they did at one of the Digimon cons, I think, a couple years ago with the, like, the main character designer for Digimon. And he really is just like, yeah, I kind of like military style fashion with or, you know, kind of like with like a lot of zippers, <laughs> like kind of yeah. like military style jackets. Dude, we know. <laughs> so, so I just like do that a lot. And you don't it's have like, to tell us. Yeah. <laughs> we, fi we figured it out, but we yeah. can see. I'm remembering another Digimon. Yes. Ojami, 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 Ojami Mommy. No. Ojami. No, Ojami. Incorrect. Incorrect. That's, you keep saying Yu-Gi-Oh Yu cards. That's incredibly wrong. <laughs> you said Karibo already. <laughs> <laughs> if it doesn't end in Mon, <laughs> I'm gonna mine. give you a hint. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even say Doraemon. <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> Doraemon, the blue cat. The blue cat who I thought you was talk a Digimon. You Doraemon all the fucking time. <laughs> oh yeah, him. <laughs> My favorite Digimon. <laughs> yeah, that one. Anyway, uh, uh, what else? What the f fuck? What the fuck am I looking at? Oh, okay, so it's got like, okay, let me just real quick scales. It's, it's, this is not a furry. It's not a furry. It's scaly. It just has. Stop yelling at it me. It has fluff. <laughs> furry, stop drawing fan art if yeah, you started. Yeah, scalies, get on this. Scalies, <laughs> begin drawing fan art now. Furries, please leave the vicinity. I am getting the fire hose. <laughs> I'm just indicating for myself that this is going to be a really annoying render real quick. Just yeah. give me a moment. <laughs> yeah. It's such an ominous pose. Well, because it, it, when you walk into its cave, question mark, it's like... Oh, it's like all the way down. Yeah. And then it sits up. Yeah, and then it's like, and then it speaks to you in a man's voice. <laughs> <laughs> and says, I'm a Digimon. <laughs> Hello, are I... you here to hunt a monster? 
That is me. me. (laughs) (laughs) I'm ready. I am not (laughs) Scooby-Doo. All right, let me do some stretches. (laughs) Yeah, I have have very long limbs. It is important that I stretch them out properly. Make sure your weapons are sharpened. Let's take five. Make sure everyone's ready. Okay, ready? Have you eaten your meat to max out your stamina bar? You're going to need stamina. I have a lot of complicated attack patterns. Yes, you will see them very soon, but I want to make sure that you are prepared. Also, just know we're going to be going to at least two other locations during this fight. I've marked them on your map. Yeah, so I hope you you stretched as well. While, (laughs) While not strictly necessary, I do recommend taking a demon drug and armor drug to boost your attack and defense respectively. It should help save you from some of the one-shot attacks I can typically inflict. This is all said with like three echo filters on. (laughs) It's important to note. Okay, I'm going to stop. Yeah. Yeah. This is just just a big guy. I love yeah, it. Oh, I should, see... Wait, wait, no, I should do just real quick. You don't want to see. I did this. No, I never want to see. You want to show me something, Jacob? I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, got it. For scale, okay. Yeah. Like my last Monster Hunter drawing. Oh, yeah. The big Tony the Tiger. <laughs> yeah. Okay, there we go. Okay. Now I want to see. He's far too large. Okay, engage, open your folder, yes. and click on Teostra Monster. <gasps> oh! You were right about the face with the, the sort of dog cat vibe. <laughs> yeah. He looks like such a Lion King. It's so yeah. cute. I love it. Yeah, he is a lion themed. Um, freaking Lion King on Broadway <laughs> Which is why over he's here. the king. Yeah. I get it. I didn't even make that connection in my head. <laughs> I actually, I love Teostra's design. I think he's great. Yeah. I would keep him as a pet. Yeah. Or he, boyfriend, whatever works. He spits out a lot of fire. I'll tell you yeah, that. I feel like I would have expected and, that. And generates incredible amounts of explosions. How big is he? He's pretty big, but he's not like one of the gargantuan ones. Is my he's scale like normal, too big? Large. I would say probably too big, yeah. Well, that's I okay. don't care. <laughs> this is what happens if you let him keep getting big. Yeah. And if you like send him to get a higher education. Yeah. 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 Well, great job, Karina. Thank I love you. this fella. Thank you. Let's do a Julia now. Me. Julia. Yeah. Are you ready to see your armor set? Uh-huh. Go ahead and activate your folder eyeball. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Shiny. Pretty. This is the Archfiend armor set. <gasps> and it comes from the monster called Geismagorm. Geismagorm. <laughs> Geismagorm. <laughs> Gorm. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> guys, guys! Guys! My gorm! My gorm! Okay. Oh, is this your gorm? Oh, looks like it's my gorm. I'm the one who has it. No, no. guys! <laughs> my gorm! My gorm! Oh, Sora! My gorm. Sora! <laughs> my gorm! Sorma! My gorma! <laughs> Anyways, uh, I'm getting okay. So Guys, like a crystal, a crystal, crystal. Dra- dragon esque thing is you kind of the vibe that I'm getting. Crystal dragon. Julia will call Yu Gi Oh monsters Digimon and just name <laughs> Yu Gi Oh monsters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> crystal dragon. Crystal dragon. I'm guys, hoping. Magorm. Guys. Guys. I was, just, I was just double checking all my information that I gave because oh, I got some. You don't want to say information about a different dragon. No, yeah. I don't want. I don't want to <laughs> say a wrong dragon in an episode again after the Elden Ring debacle. Yeah, we lost so many subscribers because you described a different lich dragon. I, I described you did Placidisax that. instead of Fortisax. Of Fortisax. Not Placidisax. Yeah. I realize what happened, by the way, is because huh? I was considering giving one of you Placidus Axe, oh. and I had the tab open as well, oh. and I misclicked into the wrong tab, and then because I was recording an episode, my brain not power enough to it happens. tell me it wrong, and then everyone in the comments, every single person in the every comments- Every single comment on that video- <laughs> actually though it wasn't that many people that said no. it no, yeah. it was, no it was like two I just want to I'm not actually calling anyone out no, no. It, yeah it you're was calling like, yourself, oh, I mean, and also you I did, was just frustrated I'll that I got it wrong out. 
<laughs> uh, well, I, I know you will, but I don't think you need to this time. But I'll let you know if you need yeah. to. Yeah. My last one of that is on our fanfic tag one. Mm. We spent so long talking about OT7. And I was like, well, there's like one specific OT7. And people thought I meant that that was the originator of the term OT7, which I don't think I said. I'm pretty sure I didn't say that. And I know that's not it. Let's roll back the tape. Let's find out. (laughs) I don't know if you said it either. I'm pretty sure I didn't. And if I did, that's not what I meant. So I apologize. But (laughs) you should assume we mean the right thing. Yeah. Yeah. Everything (laughs) we say wrong, just make it right. Just assume that we meant to say the right thing. Give us give us the benefit of the doubt that we meant it we meant the right thing. Sometimes when you're recording, you're really just <laughs> speaking. It's unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> that is so yeah, true. Dude. So, so true, true Scooby. Oh my god. <laughs> so true Scooby. We're really just speaking. <laughs> we're just speaking. But we're it's just, like we're it's, just making sounds. It's not even it's like it's yeah. different from speaking. It's not a conversation. It's just speaking. Like when I'm speaking, I try to think of what I'm going to say before I say it, but when I'm recording, a lot of times I'm just sort of making sounds that sound like words yeah. in the hopes that the sounds I make something inspire. Usable yeah. Comes out. And I'm just like, well, I sure hope if I say something incredibly stupid, the editor will get rid of it yeah. so that I still sound likable and cool. But I guess whoever edited the Elden Ring episode didn't know all the Elden Ring lore. No. So really, it's their fault. <laughs> didn't, didn't stop and go, wait a minute. Jacob, <laughs> the wrong sax. <laughs> he said the wrong sax. He sex. said the wrong we have sax. Fun here. We have fun here. Thank you for watching. Remember, we're on that two million grind. We are on that two million grind. We're desperate for that two million grind. Yeah, I'm honestly, I'm we're, sick of creeping. Yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna now. we're gonna keep saying incorrect things until we hit two million. <laughs> yeah, once we hit two million, only correct things. Here yeah. We're gonna say them so incorrect, so confidently. This is a host- hostage situation a hostage now. Situation. <laughs> <laughs> and we want the two million. <laughs> you can't situation. leave until we get the two million. My favorite thing about recording Drawfees is that I truly do not remember the things that we say in each individual episode by the following week. So oh, that week. when the when the episodes do someday come out, I'll see like a really funny quote in the comments and I'll be like, God, I hope I said that. <laughs> and sometimes I... It was me who said it, and I feel really great. <laughs> yeah, that's a great feeling when it, when it is you. Because there are like certain types of quotes where I'm like, that sounds like something I feasibly could have said. Yeah, it could have been me. It also could have been Karina who said it. Yeah. Or it could have been Nathan, depending on the quote. Sometimes we have overlap with mm-hmm, the types of jokes mm-hmm. we make. Sometimes we say the exact same thing at the exact same time. That's true. <laughs> I, I would never overlap with Julia's jokes. Julia's jokes are singular. Yeah, that's... <laughs> That's a different <laughs> And I know That's a different ball game. When I see one of them, I know it's not me. I'm like, that was Julia that said that. Yeah. Guaranteed. I'm not really sure what I want. I'm really struggling with the face here. This is You you had it looking like a race car before. I kinda <laughs> like that. I think I kinda want You can give it a man's face. Yeah. A guy's face. I think that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Human face. I do like the faces you cycled through. Each one was either giving Yu-Gi-Oh or Digimon, and you would never know. Are you thinking of like a face hole situation? Yeah. Because that's pretty cool. Face hole. Yeah, I want a face hole. I do like a face hole angle. Because like they're, it looks like they either have like a thing of crystal, like a crystal visor over their faces, or I don't know. It's There's no face, and there's like... It's just going away. into a yeah from spirit <laughs> away or it's just like a, a void blue cloud void maybe the gorm is his face <laughs> and that's why he wants to get it back oh guys my gorm <laughs> he's like, i can't Call. emote without my gorm that's my face it's like, it's i like, don't oh. i don't know what a gorm is i don't i can't give it back to you if i don't know what it is <laughs> what are you saying it's my gorm it's my gorm that's what i call face <laughs> I think I want him like also doing kind of like a kneel. How does that work um, on dragons? Well, if it has a, a person's legs, then I think you like that. Exactly. Yeah, but dragon legs are like 
They got that, right? They can. They, yeah. Dragons can be anything. <laughs> I think you can just make it up. Yeah. That's a good little steppy. That's a good little guy. He's just going like, eh. Eh. It's, it's like, all right, guys, take a knee. It's also Pikachu's <laughs> tail. Those guys, they got my gorm. <laughs> they came in here. They took my gorm. And I saw them. They're wearing it. They're wearing my gorm on their gorm. My beautiful gorm. And they're acting like it's their gorm, but it's not. Is that uh, what we're Pikachu gonna, look like? We're going to get out there and... <laughs> Why is Pikachu here? Well, hello? <laughs> one, one man's <laughs> dragon leg is another man's Pikachu tail, <laughs> as the expression goes. I got to be real. I've been half Googling Yu-Gi-Oh dragon cards because you were giving so much Yu-Gi-Oh dragon. Mm -hmm. And I just look up and I see Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> Such is life. Yeah. Such is life. <laughs> Pikachu just came in to say hello. Yeah. Hi. Pikachu just came in to say Pika. He just peeked what? in. Pika P. Oh my god. That's all, that's all it says. Oh Julia, do do what I did. Yeah, cover it with wing. If you don't want to draw it, cover it with wing. Yeah, I um <laughs> I wanted to give it a cool sitting pose and then I literally could not figure out how to do it. Yeah, that. so cover it with wing. It would be like Yeah, draw it small over there. Um one leg up sort of thing, and then one leg like There this. is a monster hunter monster. Rain. I'm Pikachu? trying to remember its name. Is it Pikachu? It's Pikachu. Is it Luigi? Luigi's but it, it does it's like the, the thing where it like stands up and covers itself in its wings and then it like teleports around like a Dracula. Oh, I like Ooh. that one. Aww. Believe it or not. What the heck's it called? I just looked at it earlier today. It's not called Dracula. Is it it's called not... Alucard? No, it's not called either of those things, believe it or not. Luigi? Is it Luigi? <laughs> <laughs> Is it Luigi's mansion? Is it... Scooby. It's called Malzino. I think it's oh, Malzino. Oh, I'd love to order a Malzino. Oh, yeah. yeah. Ooh, at times. times. <laughs> Italian. Malzino's Pizza. Aye. Oh, yeah, that's him. That's him. That's the guy. <laughs> You're just talking to yourself. <laughs> yeah, look at this guy. Aww, oh, he's that's pretty. A, that's a cool guy. He's, he's doing the wing cover. <laughs> That looks like something that would take a lot of work oh. and money to get on Flight Rising. That guy plays Reaper in Overwatch. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he kind of does do Reaper stuff. Does a little bit of Reaper stuff here and there. He's pretty edgy. But who among us doesn't? Among us. Among us. <laughs> so true, Scooby. <laughs> So do Scooby. <laughs> I feel such a mixture of emotions about that. <laughs> so do Scooby. So yeah, do Scooby. like I liked it, but at the same time, I was like really mad. Yeah, that means it's a good joke. <laughs> it makes Jacob mad. Ten out of ten. Good joke. So do Scooby. <laughs> I think that one's gonna get picked up by yeah. the, the youth. Yeah, we're gonna yeah. we're gonna make it happen. Yeah, concerted effort. <laughs> yeah, I'm like straight panicking. Well, you you feel like you're headed in a cool direction there. Yeah, it's one of those days where it's just not in my brain. It's not it's not clicking. It's... I like the faceless dragon angle. I yeah, think that's really I mean, cool. It, it's this is. I feel like you've got it. You just just give it some like some cool crystalline spikes. Yeah. And, and you're good, you're golden. I did find the Yu-Gi-Oh dragons I was looking for. This is like a mashup of two. Oh. Which, which ones? Wow. Yeah. Cyber dragon. And then here's the second one. Yeah. It looked more like this before you gave it no face. Oh, Hyozan Ryu. I didn't remember its name. It says it. Yeah, well, that's why it took me a while to find it. You can just read it. Oh, I... I <laughs> Damn, calling her out. Amazing that you face. found it at all. <laughs> Did you just like hit the keyboard and hope? No, I Google Yu Gi Oh! Normal Dragon. <laughs> and then I went into the related searches of old cards. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. This dragon's kind of like non Euclidean. <laughs> What? What did you say? What does that mean? Like it doesn't follow like the rules of geometry. Like it seems like it. Yeah, I imagine it's a bunch of like floaty, floaty bits around a vein. Yeah, you know, like a core, a crystal core. Yeah. 
my favorite Final Fantasy, Crystal Core. <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm contributing a lot to this episode today. <laughs> you do you but you Sorry, gave us I, I realized that sounded like a condescending response oh. to like your joke. I was just remembering Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. <laughs> just like, having fond that, memories. That was, good, that was a good one. It was a good Nathan game. I wasn't even talking about I, the joke. I wasn't talking about the joke. I was talking about the Final <laughs> Fantasy. I'm sorry, Julia. <laughs> Oh, you're so cringe right now. <laughs> oh, no. But then they remade it, and they didn't do a very good job from what I heard oh. with oh. the remake. Wh when did they remake it? They remade it for the Switch. Really? Yeah. They did a Crystal Chronicles remake for the Switch. Everyone was really excited, and then it was really bad. Mm. How so? I think they just like, if you can believe it, I don't think Nintendo did a good job with the multiplayer. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> what? And that's like sort of the whole crux of yeah, that game. It is. But it's like their strength is their Nintendo Online. I think everyone thought they were going to make like a functional online multiplayer version I of the see. game that people could enjoy with their friends from far away. No, you have to get your Game Boy Advances together <laughs> and everyone has to have the Game Boy Advance to GameCube connector and then you, you all meet up at one friend's house and argue over who gets to be the fun character classes. And who gets to carry the chalice. And who gets to carry the chalice. <laughs> Yeah, I remember I got that game and I think I, we successfully played it together like once with my friends. Yeah, same for me. It was like once or twice we got every all the pieces necessary to play it. Otherwise, I just played the single player mode. It was fine. They made the that sequel one for like the DS or whatever. Mm -hmm. That one was really good. Okay. And it actually did work like you would anticipate where you could play like single player and then hop on multiplayer with the same character and Ooh. play with your friends and i don't know why they couldn't just like do that again <laughs> you can't just do it again who knows who i'm knows? not a game developer i'm a legendary artist revered the world <laughs> over i kind of dig in where this is where this is going yeah, Julia. Yeah. You, you did such a complicated pose it's kind of like a cool weird it's Yu-Gi-Oh. It weirds me out. That's what I wanted. It's Yu-Gi-Oh. I wanted a weird one. You it's, did it. It's definitely weirder than anything they make in Monster well, Hunter. Well, I feel like in Monster Hunter, they give you either like this cool like Silent Hill-esque monster or they give you like lizard. They do so, love to give you a lizard. Sometimes they give you a rude ape. <laughs> That's true, yeah. <laughs> Very occasionally. They give you also a couple of crabs. <gasps> crabs and a couple, a couple. of spiders. <gasps> Quiders. You can give me a crab to and, draw, Jacob. And they give you exactly one bat. One bat. If you want to kill a bat, <laughs> you may kill a bat once. <laughs> you may kill this one bat. <laughs> there might be more than the one bat. I'm going to hedge my knowledge here. There could be more. I just know about you know, the one you bat. You know what happens if you say incorrect information. <sighs> Yeah, everyone, please correct him <laughs> in the comments down below and tweet at him on Twitter. Thanks. Thanks. I love it. <laughs> I love it. You better get your apology written. <laughs> Preemptive apologetic tweet. I've got like a form I mean, that I have blanks on where I can just slot in. To be fair, <laughs> basically every video we make is a YouTuber apology video. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. We always apologize. Yeah. So the we're sorry at the end, you know, it's for that as well. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. It's for <laughs> talking about placidus acts instead of fortis acts. Working plordus acts. Where were the names? <laughs> <laughs> the joke even works better with the actual name, which is Fortisac. Which, which well, we yeah, did, that's the in, one that I did in, in, the, the in the episode. So I was so. trying to bring it's it back. It's been done. It's but been the other done. Placidisax. Working working Placidisax. It's not Plordisax. Working Placidisax. <laughs> Well, if you combine them, <laughs> then you get Plordisax. Mm. Uh, I guess. I guess you could if you wanted. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if you insist. If you have to. You gonna put Pikachu back over there? <laughs> Pikachu has not been in Monster Hunter as far as I know. Yet. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> 
frog legs? Yeah, why has he got frog legs? <laughs> why has he got tail arms? Does he have a... No. That's Raichu. <laughs> oh, Julia, I'm so sorry. You drew Raichu by accident. <laughs> <laughs> not well, gonna write think... you a love song. Julia, you are thinking of your weird demon. You're okay. thinking of the demon Pikachu that's in your house. You forgot the bow tie. <laughs> yeah, where's this bow tie? <laughs> and why isn't he doing a little flip and barking? There you go. Oh, man. There's that. Yeah. All righty. <laughs> Are you uh, done, Julia? Yeah. Get me out of here, man. <laughs> I'll fix this in post. It'll Free her. make more sense later. I, I like it. I think it's cool. It's like a serpent. A snurpent. With wangs. Yeah. With wangs. I mean, I keep saying it being very annoying, but also it's true. This is giving big Yu-Gi-Oh card. A lot of Yu-Gi-Oh dragons are these like very compact. They got a similar vibe. I dig it. Yeah, and they're twisty want... and can fun. I, can I get rid of this guy and just, <laughs> just have do my Pikachu. Monster Hunter be this? I, I, I just <laughs> noticed it's saying I'm Pikachu, but it's not a word bubble. It's, no, an, it's arrow an arrow <laughs> pointing from I'm Pikachu. Pikachu yeah. drew this. Yeah, it's yeah. very cursed. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't even... <laughs> oh my it's gosh. not even here. I, right. so I would love Delete it. Delete your art. I would love it if instead of doing this, we could look at okay. our friend Guys McGorm. Show us the Gorm. Show us the Gorm. Guys. Oh. What a friend. He's that is a, not what I thought at he all. He does have a big hole in his face, but yeah. it's his mouth. Yeah, his mouth opens really big yeah. and it's glowy inside of there. Oh, he looks like he eats fruit. <laughs> you know, yeah. Yeah, it looks like you give him, you give him an orange, yeah, a whole goes, orange, and he goes, "Whoop!" <laughs> yeah. So do Scooby. <laughs> I'm also getting vibes of Nathan's uh, space shark Ooh. with like the gills and the arm. Oh yeah, it does of kind of have. It looks like it has two sharks coming out of the side of its head. It in also it, in it, each of us is two sharks. When you fight him, he does lots of um, like glowing and lighting up in various ways. Damn, he lights up. <laughs> Damn, he's lit. He's pretty lit. Hmm. Almost as lit as this episode was. Mm. Wow. <laughs> Thank you for watching. You're welcome. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. Thank you here in the room for watching us do the episode we just recorded. Anytime, and, Scooby. And thank you at home. Thank all you Scoobies at home for watching. That's what we're going to call our fan base from now on. Scoobies. <laughs> what up, Scoobs? What's up, Scoobs? <laughs> we're grinding for, for two million. Oh. If you know a friend who might become a fellow Scooby, <laughs> join the Scooby them. fam. Join Scooby the fam. The Mystery Inc., one may say. <laughs> you probably got at least one friend who's a, a candidate for, for being Scoobed. Do you know someone who wouldn't hate this? <laughs> Boy, do we got the channel for you. Yeah. We already talked about stream, but we have a merch store too. Yeah, we got a Patreon, please. We got a Patreon, please. We can only do this show with all y'all Scoobies contributing Donating your, your Scooby, Scooby snacks. snacks. Yes! Yeah! Jacob, we finally did a joke in unison. You just That's said so we did beautiful. it. I feel like we're at, at one right now with each yeah, other. And the episode before we ruin it. We're sorry. 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 Sorry.